I am Kano Nuklak, founder of the Institute of Entropy, and this is my presentation of my final paper on Mellimeter. Today I will prove why SpongeBob is a good Mellimeter, and let's start with who is SpongeBob. A SpongeBob's corpus is an energetic and optimistic sea sport who lives in a pineapple underwater. SpongeBob has such childlike enthusiasm for life which carries over to his job as a fry cook at the fast food restaurant called the Krusty Krab. SpongeBob loves the restaurant business so much that he got a job at the Krusty Krabs when he was only 13 years old. He was awarded the title of the Worker of the Month 364 times. Let's consider what qualities of a real manager he has based on the cutter. He loves his job. In Krusty Krab, he sometimes works as a cleaner, his uh, waiter, and sometimes he is left as the main, so his main job is a cook. Uh, this proves that he is incredibly dedicated to this because he really loves his jobs, which, in my opinion, is the most important part for a good manager. Uh, able to adapt to any work environment. Due to his flexibility and ability to adapt to new working conditions, uh, SpongeBob was able to work in all positions, thanks to which uh, he knows every stage of the restaurants. In turns, this allows you to effectively manage the infestation because it knows the specifics of all processes. And the next is always have a positive attitude and works hard. He's a very good manager because while he has slayed the employees, he doesn't lose his positive attitude and know how to leave all the Krusty Krabs customers satisfied and deliciously fed. Next to him uh, is, is the most popular restaurant in Bikini Bottle. This season, SpongeBob had different tasks, but his main mission was to save the secret Krabsburger recipe from Plankton, who came up with different plans to steal the recipe. For the season, SpongeBob has succeeded. Resist Plankton's attempt to get inside his head and get the secret recipe, break down the many robots and gadgets which uh, he wanted to get the recipe, reconcile the employees uh, the William wanted to quarrel with, have the restaurant exploding and much more. But uh, SpongeBob always brought Plankton out in the open and forced him to confess to the crime. By reuniting all of his completed tasks, I built a gun card that clearly shows all of his uh, accomplishments over time. As you can see. Uh, now let's talk about what management functions SpongeBob does. And the first is a planning. Uh, a short story. Plankton has framed Crossburger and Neptune has uh, threatened it to kill him if he doesn't get the crown back. But uh, in this situation, Bob decides to uh, save Mr. Krabs and get the crown back, determine the goal and what uh, his friends must do to achieve this goal. In the planning process, he conducted a comprehensive analysis of the current situation in which all the people of Bikini Bottom and themselves agreed with Neptune on the timeline of uh, implementation uh, delivery the crown back, developed a plan to get Shoal City and deliver the crown on time, identified the participants, his friends, and distributed among them the necessary tasks, and ensured that the task set for each time period was uh, completed. Thanks to management function, such as planning, SpongeBob saved crabs, uh, Mr. Krabs and all the people of Bikini Bottom. But now let's talk about the organizational function. Uh, during the anchovy invitation in Krusty Krabs, when the restaurant was completely full and staff couldn't cope with the flow of customers, uh, SpongeBob uh, soberly uh, set the situation, distributed the tasks to be performed, and provide everything necessary for work. It's finances, uh, 
consumables, and the most important is equipment. With the help of a super spatula, he was able to prepare a crash burger for everyone very quickly and coordinate the work in time. Thus, with the help of the innovational function, as Penny Bob ensured a rational combination in time and space of all elements of the production process of the most efficient acquisition of the current situation in Krusty Krabs. Also, it's uh, very important to touch on the motivational function. Uh, one day, Squid tricked SpongeBob into telling him that the guy over there named Frank really wanted to be a cook. And he couldn't cook while SpongeBob was serving. Uh, food, of course, that wasn't true. But SpongeBob motivating Frank, who had never even thought about cooking before, so much that he quickly learned to cook and serve and working at starting working at Krusty Krab. SpongeBob using the motivational function of management and encouraged Frank to work uh, to meet the restaurant's goal. Uh, Bob mentally st uh, stimulated him by telling him about his wonderful job, as uh, him uh, as uh, himself really uh, loved it and uh, create a comfortable environment for Frank's learning and self development. The next is system approach. Uh, SpongeBob runs the open system because the Krusty Krabs is a restaurant that depends on a change in the external underwater world, uh, for example, new information, events, materials, products, and must always adapt to change in order to stay afloat and maintain the leading positions. Let's look at this with a concrete example. Even though the Krusty Krab restaurant is popular, there was a change in the external environment. Customers got tired uh, of the regular craft burger and they stopped with it. But after 36 days of no customers in the Krusty Krabs, SpongeBob decided to adapt to change the demand and came up with his idea of colorful craft burger to attract an audience. A couple of hours later, SpongeBob recognized his idea, and more than 400,000 customers lined up for burgers and returned to Krusty Krab. Next is continuity approach. Explore this approach, uh, consider as an example the handjob method of control from cotton cereals majority. He chose a method of Mating Smashart by recording uh, them in the scary book in case of disobedience in the production of the dance. And as a, as a result, Smasharki performed brilliantly with new dance. But uh, why won't this method work for Smash Book? Uh, uh, the weak method, the scary book in case of SpongeBob, after all, will not work at all. First, Mr. Krabs and Squidward was simply laughed at him instead of obey. Second, the carrot method is much better in his case, with encouraged the motivation and basic employees of Krusty Krabs to be able to work correctly and happily next to SpongeBob. And uh, third, SpongeBob is not a character who could uh, work in such harsh uh, and in, in commenting the way. So, the next is objectives and tasks for Krusty Krab. Uh, the main goals are to present to the customers a relatively new product or service, uh, expansion of sales geography, and maintain profit growth uh, proportional to sales growth. So, for new product, we need to improve optimization of production, labor, and management, use the latest achievements in production, and uh, interrupt uh, uh, the rhythmical manufacture of high quality products according to available production capacities. Uh, for expansion of sales geography, we need to develop of a strategy and 
characteristics of the enterprise behavior in the new market and maintains of the uh, competitiveness of enterprise and products, maintains of the high image of the enterprise and new environment, and for maintain for profit we need satisfaction of social needs of the products uh, willful demands of the consumers formation of efficient market policy effective use of production resource a, a fixed capital material financial and labor resource increase uh, production efficiency the value that spongebob teaches is a pay to fail uh, spongebob hasn't even really gotten the hand of Berlin, even after 20 years of living in Bikini Bottom. But he did remind us that it's okay to fail. Sometimes multiple attempts are needed to secure the goal you want. Uh, but SpongeBob dem demonstrated you should never give up. This is belief in your dream. From the very first episode, he showed us how he achieved his goals is working at Questy Crabs. Uh, becoming employee of the month hundred of times in the row. In the next is, you can always count on your friend. As a resident of Bikini Bottom, with us, you can always count on those near and far to get through life. And also, you have to be a good friend who will always come of rescue, like Spongebob. The next is, don't forget to have fun. Uh, SpongeBob taught us uh, to find what you love, to seek out the good, and somehow turn everything you do into an enjoyable activity filled with fun. Playedness of the environment. For this topic, let's take two main external parts. It's uh, five buses containing crowds of hungry employees and the existence of super spatula. Uh, short history. Uh, when SpongeBob wanted a job at Krusty Krabs, he was sent on an impossible assignment to buy a seemingly non existent super spatula. After he left, hungry anchovies arrived at Krusty Krabs that the employees couldn't handle. But uh, SpongeBob found the spatula fed all the anchovies and become Krusty Krabs' new employee. If SpongeBob hadn't found the spatula, he wouldn't have been hired because it was a condition and Krusty Krabs would have had many dissatisfied, hungry customers and a ruined reputation. On the other hand, uh, if he had found a super spatula, but the anchovies hadn't come, the uh, spatula wouldn't have been uh, useless and he wouldn't have been hired. From this, we can deduce that uh, without the spatula, the anchovy buses are not fed, and without the anchovy invitation, the spatula is unnecessary in this situation. So that's all. Thank you for your attention. Bye.